Alright, so, this is where the stealth element in the game starts to take place. This is where we want it. So, we want to unlock the CTOS box. Alright, we are entering a restricted area. Alright, and this is where we want the suppressed handgun that we were... That we started out with in the game. There we go. Headshot. Always go for the headshot. Headshots with your silenced handgun will keep you stealthy. Right, another good way to uh, take these guys out without attracting attention is to use your hacking skills and look for opportunities that might disrupt these guys or kill them. If we can get a better angle, that'd be nice. Alright, so this guy is right by a box with explosives, so... Booyah! Killed him. So you can activate random stuff that will... That will, um, distract them. And then there are other things that you can use that will kill them, such as the explosives, like we just used here. Alright, so, what I would do is attract them in an, in the, in, like, I'd set off something that's not in your general area. That way it'll give you something to, uh, oh shit. Headshot there. Alright. Shit. Oh shit. Oh. Fuck. Alright. Get to cover. And once all else fails, then we start getting into a gun battle. Oh shit. Him out. Reload. Oh no, 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 no. Hey, we need some extra bodies here. Kill him before he calls reinforcements. That red triangle. Shows the reinforcements. You do not want him to call reinforcements. Oh shit. I just picked up a random submachine gun. Alright, there we go. Nice. And that is that. So who am I hacking? This guy's phone. Pick up as much stuff as you possibly can. You will appreciate it later on in the game. And do not explode that, because you can kill yourself with the explosives in this game. Right, can I open that up? No, I guess I can't. But yeah, you want to take out these guys as... Or obviously these guys are dead, but... You want to take any enemies out as much as you can while you're still undetected so obviously I didn't get many guys without being detected but at least to get the general idea alright now we need to intrude on the security here alright here we go the hacking process of the game this is where the game loses me while at the same time you know I'm sort of impressed by this game a little I'm impressed by this part a little bit. All right, so we start at a we start with a source of connection, this blue box here, and we need to connect the dots or the line basically to the end source, which is this white box. And as you can see, by flipping these power lines here, that will get us to where we need to be. Now, obviously, they'll get harder and harder. 
So as long as they connect to each other, you're golden. So there we go. Get to the, match the lines up to the end box, and then we move on. And then there will be some um, connectors where if you turn it into a certain angle, we now have a certain time now where we have to complete the puzzle. Obviously, this one's really easy, so, you know, eight seconds, we're already done. But others won't be so easy. And we are now in the CTS database. We've been hearing that a lot, CTOS. My bad, CTOS, that's what I meant to say. We've been see, um, seeing CT, CTOS, excuse me. CTOS stands for Central Operating System. That is basically what connects us as or is basically what connects all of the city's um, technology on, that is run on a circuit. So, we will find out what we are hacking here in a second. Oh, that's somebody's home. Jeez. What was that? That's inside someone's home. Looks like CTOS is compiling every intimate detail from private citizens. It's no wonder DedSec despises CTOS. Yeah, really, I would too if they were spying on me. This is the Big Brother government that's watching us. Alright, so there's literally, there are, there's a lot of files that you could just hack if you're interested in seeing them. But you see, you get the idea now of what it is, but we're interested in the campaign mission, so... We have now hacked into the CTOS system of Central Chicago, and now we have. You're in the CTOS. We are in the CTOS now. <clears throat> I'm looking at the network as we speak. You've got your access, and I've got mine. Profiler systems online. Everybody's nasty little secrets at the click of a button. This thing's highlighting all kinds of stuff in the district. I could take advantage of some of this. Keep an eye out for online traffic. It could be fixers in the network. If I can see them, they can see me. All right, I gotta move. I mean, a lot of noise here. Give me time to track your caller. I'll be in touch. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here. Yeah, you gotta be careful with your uh, with your driving, because killing random civilians brings your reputation down. What the hell, a fixer? I made too much noise in the loop. This guy's found me. Well, now I better find him. Jody's job will have to wait. Two X the tap. There's kind of a delay on the horn for some reason. I don't really like that. It kind of annoys me. Alright, so now we gotta find this guy. This hacker. Oh, 
All right, and the problem is with uh, fixers, we have no idea who they are. And now, right now, as you can see, he is trying to hack us. Look for big crowds of people and then just profile them. As you get more into the circle and start profiling more people, you'll get your, your search, my bad, your search radius will narrow down, making it easier for you. Hold on, where are these people? Where is this guy? Okay, narrow the search area. Come on, Aiden. Find him quick. Yeah, we're already at thirty percent. Hold on. Start hacking. Come on, where is he? Not the hacker. There you are. Got him. Now. Kill him. There we go. Son of a bitch. Wait. Oh no. There's a shootout going on right now. You have to send the police. Shooter, no. I didn't want to have to do that. God damn it. Alright, wait for somebody to call the cops. Fixers are mercenaries. They work for a paycheck. Someone's issued a contract on me. That's bad fucking news. Hold on. Alright. If I remember right, Shit. yes. You guys communicate through the grid. All right, that's why you want to be careful with guns. No, that's weird. You're asexual. Uh, <laughs> no preference, but yourself, then, huh? Anyway, um, <laughs> so yeah. In terms of the police, you do not want the police to be notified. If you thought they were a pain in the ass to get away from get out. in Grand Theft Auto 5. You're going to hate him in this game. <sighs> Alright, hold on a second. We got to do this. No, not that. Alright, so yeah, online hacking. To be quite honest, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I didn't pay attention to this part a lot when this game first came out. So, I don't really know a whole lot about it, nor do I know, nor do I care enough about it. Yeah, so this part requires down. you to be online. I'd love to For some reason, my dumbass connection isn't working right now, so, yeah. I don't really, I don't really focus on that. That's just optional. All right, let's go to the campaign. All right, now I can deal with Jordy's job. Some kind of driving contract, delivering a guy somewhere. This won't be a typical taxi service. The trick with these jobs is avoiding the cops. Yep. So yeah, you, there's optional missions like Criminal Convoys, I'll probably do one later on, but there are literally so many side missions in this game, like just optional ones that pop up randomly, it's, there's too many, in my yeah. opinion. <laughs> 